Good morning guys, welcome to today. Today's the first day of school. I uh, hope for hopefully any of you guys starting back today have an awesome first day. I know a lot of you guys started back a few weeks ago. Anyway, I have our whiteboard all set up for today. It is all ready. The girls came in last night and they sat at their computers and they looked at the board and Gabby said, I liked it a lot better, just pure white. <laughs> and I'm like, yeah, I'm sure you did. That's my great poor book. Morning. This one's empty. I like this one. <laughs> Gabby, show them what color your all your binders are. Red, red, and unicorn. Yeah, we don't have. I don't know what we're gonna use that for yet. No, I know what I'm going to use it for. What? Italian. Italian. Yeah, Gabby I, wants to learn Italian because she's yeah, per Italian. I, I like this book, it's it already is. written in it. <laughs> that's, that's from when Gabby was in grade four. That's not actually one of your books this year, but it's just an extra. Yeah. It is 8 a.m. and we are Those about are to get mine. started. This is our They're morning mine. basket. Essentially, we'll do this on the couch. This is what, how we start our morning. I'll, get, I'll show you guys a little bit more about it. Basically, we do our morning routine Gabby together um, in the living room. And by together, I mean us, which is like super important because we're all learning. And our dogs Good because Bobby. I mean, they have to be here too. They have to go to school. Our dogs go to school with us. Grade four and um, no, what? is it Macy in grade five? And I'm in grade six because I'm like. In yeah, grade I guess that's true. And Cookie must be in grade three. All right. <laughs> So this is our morning basket and basically on a rotation we work through all of that stuff every morning together. So the girls have their writing tablets. So if I ask them a spelling, ooh, if I ask them a spelling word, they can just put it down really quick and show me that they know it. Don't wreck it, Sophie. Yeah, don't wreck it. Wow, that looks pretty interesting. I know. Um, anyway, lots of fun stuff, and we're ready to get started. Are you guys ready to get started on your first day of school? His pelvis bone is shaped like a dish to hold his internal organs. bar and I'm just waiting for the girls to come up. It's actually really nice out today. I'm looking forward to some nice amazing fall weather, fall rides. I want to take over this for some trail rides, local trail rides. So that's coming up soon in a video as well. It's tied in a knot so it can't go looser. Or Daddy, you see me Stella? No, I didn't see Stella. She is so good. Because she ate. They're like, what's happening? I was just having my afternoon snooze.
Can you please hold up the rest? You don't want your Lemieux one? No, I need a break from that one. Every time Gabby uses her Lemieux uh, saddle pad, she's hoping that it actually works good for him because she's falling more and more in love with it. Like these little tabs make it, they help hold it up too. Sometimes this moves down on us. I also love this saddle pad too. What kind is it? Uh, I forget what it's called. Uh, it doesn't have the little straps to hold it on. I forget what this one's called. Gabby has a couple like these too. Another one that I can't I pronounce, but Oglivy I think it is. Um, anyway, I really like these ones. I'm gonna get my own saddle pad. I already know exactly which one I want, even what color. Are what? you jealous? No. What? I want a light pink one, like the one Storm has on right now. The Lemieux. I want a light pink Lemieux. But oh, somebody and I'll be said they have a peacock green one. Oh, I think that would be amazing too. No, not the green. So I think that from now on, those are the ones I'm gonna buy for the girls because they really like those. Mom, well, not just those. Which I'm basically not. means we could start a collection all over again because we only have one. Mm -hmm. Because we have to um, exercise Stella five days a week. Poor Storm's getting exercise five days a week too. He's like, really? Come on, just let me have a rest. You'll rest. You'll rest, my love. Guys. Like, Guys. just let me have a rest. Guys. Stella's teeth are so gross. I want to take a toothbrush and brush her teeth. Do you, is that a thing? Do people brush horses' teeth? She does not let you look at her teeth. <clears throat> Yuck. I know, yeah. <laughs> She's like, come on. That's personal. Is that a booger <laughs> I see? Yeah, wipe it out. No. Where are our wet wipes? He was about to roll. We came a little later today because the girls wanted to ride with friends and some kids should be here in the next 20 minutes or so. Is she doing better today? Yes. Stella rides much better for us after she's had all of her breakfast. But she kind of looks chubbier again today. happening over there. Are you trying to get your whip? Why are you doing that? Western trot. I was walking down by the pier in a thunderstorm on the same side where we first kissed many odd years ago. I was feeling some kind of wonder when you called my name. And every time I closed my eyes to the world, you would open them up again. It's such a messed up place.
She's fast. <laughs> One weird thing about riding is that most sports have a season. They stop and they start throughout seasons. And uh, riding is like all year round. You do it all year round. Although I know a lot of you guys don't ride in the winter because you don't have a facility um, to ride in. But we ride all year round. Uh, every year at Christmas, uh, the horses get two weeks off. Like the student, the school horses get two weeks off. And the first week of school, they uh, horse the school horses get the week off. Our horses, of course, still have to be exercised because they're only ridden once by us. Starmus barrel racing the stool. <laughs> just kidding. Um, I know a lot of you guys said, don't barrel race in an English saddle. They're just fooling around, you guys. Whenever, whenever they do this kind of stuff, they're just fooling around and playing, and it's not like real. It's not dangerous. It's not as dangerous as when they do it with real speed and all the right equipment. They're just fooling around. Uh, this is school, you guys. This is part of our gym class. Our kids are doing... Um, a horseback riding for school. You guys get to horseback ride for school. Like this is a part of our school day and we put it into our curriculum so that they can ride during school. You're gonna jump? Gabby's addicted to bareback now. Absolutely addicted. I was just talking to my friend about Stella and trying to figure out what breed that she is. And um, another friend was telling me that you, you can do DNA testing on horses as well as people so i want to look into that like wouldn't that be the coolest thing i actually am going to look into it if i can remember when i get home i always said that gabby just needed time to be here by herself and practice on her own to really get more comfortable with something and that's really been working for her right sophie is mixing it up She's got some ground poles. She's got some poles on the ground and that's what her and Stella are gonna practice.
Gabby's very first time ever riding bareback. I mean, riding backwards. And now she sits up tall. <laughs> Gabby, you, you ride better sitting backwards. Go again. that I can't read my Bible. I, the words are so small. So I'm here at the bookstore with the girls trying to find a Bible and I found this. So it's a Bible, but you can color and journal in it. So it's got all these like pictures and stuff on the sides that you can color and doodle and it's got pages or word letters so that you can write stuff. The only problem is is that it's a bit small still. But I love it. And I love the feel of it too. Right you guys, look at this. Sophie is dying for this rabbit hutch. It's true we already have a rabbit hutch, but this is a different one. They would each have their own rabbit hutches. No, but we would share one of the baby bunnies and Yeah, the but extras. this time when we're looking at Schleich, Mom and Dad said Yes. No. We said no, Dad you said guys. Maybe for these. Dad said maybe. Ah, oh, you ruined it. Then you can say at least I've tried. The first. And don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.